Staking Deadheads and Skull Troopers. Let's go ahead and jump right on into it. Staking a Deadhead or Skull Trooper allows the team to use that specific one in any of their shows, movies, or other content that they produce. The reason staking is required for the team to be able to use those NFTs in their content is because whoever is holding the NFT is actually the owner of all of the rights to it as well, both commercial and non-commercial rights, which means if they want to use it, they need to get your permission first. They have multiple different time options available for staking. The reason why they do this is so that they know how long they have to use that deadhead or that skull trooper in their content before they might lose the rights to use it again. Also for the entire duration that you decide to stake your NFT for, you cannot sell it or transfer it during this entire time. Time. But you will also earn weekly show tokens the entire duration you decided to stake your Deadhead or Skull Trooper for. The amount that you earn per week is actually going to vary depending on how long you decide to stake it for. The team also just released version 2 of staking. One of the big goals for their version 2 was to lower the gas fees to make it more affordable for people to be able to stake their Deadheads and Skull Troopers. Also with version 2, you will no longer receive or be minting a staked version of your NFT that you actually put into that casting pool. Instead, you'll actually just be able to see your NFT whenever you sign in on their owner's dashboard with your wallet. They do, however, have plans to airdrop a staked version of both your Deadheads and Skull Troopers through the Polygon network at a later date. I personally have already staked one of my two Skull Troopers. I staked it for the entire two year duration that I could. I decided to stake my Skull Trooper for the full two years because I really believe in the project and I really subjectively like the look of my Skull Trooper leader that I ended up staking, so I feel like it has a very good chance of actually being used in the show or movie. I currently have not staked my second Skull Trooper, but I do plan on doing so in the near future when I have a little bit more Ethereum. However, I will not be staking my Deadhead, as instead I'm actually going to be burning it along with my Dead Ticket to turn it into an evolved Halo Head. I'm actually going to walk you through exactly how to stake any Deadhead or Skull Trooper. The first thing you're going to need to do is head over to Deadhead's official website, deadheads.io, and then from there, make your way to the owner's dashboard. From here, you're going to need to connect your MetaMask wallet, and then on the left, there's an option that is stake. Once you're on the staking tab, you'll then need to select if you're going to stake a Deadhead or a Skull Troop. You then will have to select exactly which Deadheads or Skull Troopers you want to be staking and how long you'd like to stake them for. You also will have to accept the staking and licensing agreement. You will then have to approve the staking contract through MetaMask. There will be a small gas fee associated with this, but this is the only time you'll ever have to do it. After approving the staking contract, it may take a minute or two to verify. Once the verification is done, it'll move on and you'll have to approve the transaction through MetaMask. The Deadhead or Skull Troopers that you selected to be staked will now be removed from your wallet but they will still be visible under the owner's dashboard on the official Deadhead's website. You also will be able to see the exact release date of your staked assets so that you know exactly when you'll get them back and when you'll be able to sell them if you're interested in doing so. One other thing you can see is how much show you have accumulated over the staking process. And that's it. Now your Deadheads and Skull Troopers are officially entered into the casting pool, so make sure to keep an eye out for them in all of Deadhead's future content.